Basically. Say that again. That was really that was really deep. Oh yeah. You can't recreate. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just edit out when I said oh, say you're that silly. again. You're so silly. <laughs> Do you think everything you see is one take now? The magic no, I know the magic the happens, but <laughs> I don't. Uh, that's I don't think you should participate. Huh. All right, don't repeat that. That <laughs> there was one moment in time, and right, it's over. Let's it's go over. Forward. Maybe there will be another moment. Right. So who is this boy? So tell us about him. Well, um, I met him on my first day at the Art Institute. Is actually. he another student? Yes, there? he's okay. a senior in okay. painting, and. Um, <laughs> is that, do we allow that, I Nancy? That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, we, we, just, we, want, to, we want to know where that line is. <laughs> <laughs> the line is always gray. The line is never exactly there. <clears throat> and and so, I, what's his story? What is he about? What does he want in his life? Who is he? Well, he studied in New York all last year, and that's actually how we started talking, you know, because I've always wanted to go to New York. I went once, but we, I was with an orchestra, and we just played in a cathedral and then packed up and left. And, um, I don't know, ever since then we've been talking and we, I, there's, oh, oh God, beautiful garden, the Kaufman Gardens. Mm -hmm. It's over there. Yes. I haven't been there yet. They're but so there. amazing. Well, this time of year, there's really nothing there, right. but during the spring and the summer, they are fabulous. So I told him about these gardens and we went there one day and he read me poetry. Aww. He read me poetry and we walked through the flowers. Whose poetry? The gardens. Um, T.S. Eliot. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Which one? That's a... Oh, I believe it was Proof Rock. <laughs> and um, I don't know. We just had. We just, so much, no. It's it's not a romantic poem, but the his... way he wrote it was beautiful. His diction is just amazing. And um, I think he said the reason why Andy was holding up a flag is Elliot's a little on the pink side, so when we wonder how straight a boy is who's reading Elliot to somebody. But that's okay. If you get Yates on the second date. Might want to. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like. That's what um, with my best friend. <laughs> I feel like you have to make an exception for art school. Yeah. Well, yeah, they're all it probably. Like, it is like foreign. It's the foreign thing. It screws up the gaydar. Artist. <laughs> foreign. Screws up the Israeli. Gaydar. Israeli. Really, really screws up the gaydar. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Well, so, so anyway, poetry. I had written my own poem and mm -hmm. I had memorized it, and so I recited that for him. And very it, nice. It impressed him a lot. I think it's a very good poem. I'm proud of it myself. Okay. And um, I don't know. We just, you know, talk all the time after that. And he didn't have a girlfriend at that point in time, and I didn't have a boyfriend. And then all of a sudden, you know, we had just been friends. We had just been talking, and then all of a sudden, he had a girlfriend. Because yeah. I think it's what she said. You know, we were both too timid, and neither of us jumped at it. So in the meantime, we went and we found somebody you else. Do, you, know, you have to go for what you want. Can't always stand back. That's true. Yeah. We uh, yeah. we wandered <laughs> over there earlier, by the way, <laughs> and kind of kind of checked out the studio space. Mm -hmm. the sculpture. I sculpture. I sculpture. Sculpture's a neat building. Yeah. Yeah. It was all open, and so we oh. went in, and there was all these student like pieces, like, and there was a lamb's head piece, which was especially meaningful for us because Andy. Was I'm also head. using lamb's head as a medium. Exactly. <laughs> the lamb's head. Okay. <laughs> and, and the first one was rendered at my house, so you know, so it was like, yeah, yeah the first one was the first one. Yeah, the first one was rendered at my house. Yes, the first one. <laughs> oh, I guess you're right. Yeah. Really? Yeah. For some reason, I'm thinking rendering is mm -hmm. like when you render fat. Yeah. Like you, you took a real lamb. You took head, a ram's yes. and head. You rendered. Rendered the fat off, so there was just the skull. Okay. It was given to me as a present and it had the brain and the eyes and the tongue and all of that and I yeah. had to remove that part of it. How long did it take? Eight hours? Ten mm, hours? More like 16. And it was pretty stinky, but we, we yeah, cleaned out the place. We, had to wear, yeah. like, handkerchiefs. we didn't do that. Oh, we're no. boys. That's we're fine. Boys, yeah. exactly. <laughs> no, no. My time. vegetarian roommate was not so appreciative. That's why we didn't do it there. That's why we didn't do it there. Yeah. He just that just that I was keeping the lamb head in the freezer How was did a you little. Lamb head, by the way? Um, yeah, where did you acquire this? It was actually it was a it was a present at the time. The first one. From uh, I guess we were boyfriend at the time. You were boyfriend. I don't know when the boyfriend time, yeah. conversation happened. He, he was, was a, he was a checker at a supermarket. He was kind of slumming it for a little bit, and so uh, in the Bosnian part of St. Louis, and the Bosnians apparently love Very the lamb's for heads. Soup. So he, he got that for me as a present, and I said, I will make art from this lamb head. Oh, very and so cool. that's an ongoing process. That's really 
That is neat. That is. See, I wish I could get like a lamb head and be like.